uh, huge turnout for truck training today. 100 to 200 vehicles, I would say. And Fox News from Washington, D.C. is over there. Check, check. That's loud. Everybody's here. Yeah, huge crowd, huh? today. Really appreciate it here in Santa Barbara County with the patriots that live here and the ones that are out of the county. I want to introduce, introduce myself. My name is Leanne Wolliver and Charlie, he is the one who does all of the trunk trains up and down. <laughs> Southern California. So I'm, I'm very happy to have him on my team. And so I want to go ahead and say a prayer. Please take your hats off. Yes. Absolutely. Are you serious? Our Heavenly Father, we thank you for the many blessings. We ask you to bless each and every one of us today that we can make a difference and an impact. We ask you to protect President Trump, protect us today, and protect everybody and that we can get the word out and that we love President Trump. We love our, our San Inez Valley Patriots. We ask you to protect each one in, one of them today. We ask that Biden does not retire here. We do not want him here. Amen. We love our country. We love our county. He can just stay in the East Coast as far as I'm concerned. Anyway, um, amen. 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 Thank you. Second off, wow, that's loud. I just got to not talk so loud. Thank you all for coming out. Thank you. Can we get a Trump 2024? Please take your hats off. Please raise your hand and keep them raised if you are a veteran, an active duty soldier, a first responder. Thank all of you so much for your service. Give them a round of applause. Please keep your hats off and pledge the flag. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the Republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Woo! You got the first sample? You got ready?
USA, 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 I just want to say one thing. If uh, I want to see California go back to Republic. How about you guys? You want to go back to Republic? I'm asking everybody to go on the website and go to two, newcaliforniastate.com because that is a We the People movement and that's what we're working on doing is going is having a Republic again in our state of California. Thank you. Before we do anything else, please, if you want to get on the list for all of my rallies, we have them all over Ventura County, all the way down to Orange County. We're going to be doing some more around here. September 28th, Saturday, September 28th, will be a Santa Barbara swarm. we got to take over Santa Barbara with Trump. So put that on your calendar. If you want to get on my list, go to 805patriots.com and go to where it says get on list, send me all of your information, your phone number and name, and I'll put you on the list. It goes directly to me and I can add you right then and there. So please go ahead and do that. Um, before we go over the route, I have a few people that are running for office today. We have Elijah Mack, we have Leanne, we have a few other people if you wanna come and just say who you are and what you're doing. Where are you, Elijah? Right there. Oh, okay, come over here. You're gonna have to get up here. Oh, okay. yeah. Yeah. Wow. Good morning, everyone. My name is Elijah Mack, and I am running at the age of 19 to become California's youngest ever state senator. And so I believe in this state, what we need most of all is unity. Ultimately, what it comes down to is a lot of individuals, Republicans, independents, Democrats, whatever, recognize that the regime in California is failing. They recognize that the Democrats here have had a supermajority in both houses of our legislature, and they've held a Democrat governor for years and years and years, if not decades now. There's absolutely nothing stopping them from putting forth, forth any solutions they want to any of the issues our state faces. Yet, continually, we see increasing levels of violent crime, unaffordability, unvetted immigration, etc., etc., etc. The issue is, so many people recognize this, but they still think, because of the negative connotations and the, the uh, character destruction of Republicans, that voting, just keeping, continuing voting Democrat is still voting for the lesser of two evils. They're still in that mindset. And so what I want to do in my campaign is I've been reaching out to moderates, to young people. I've been trying to reach them with fundamentally conservative principles, common ground ideals, unitive principles that they can get behind and reaching out to them with language that they find more approachable. And so I'm happy to say that I've heard back from Democrats telling me that I'm the first Republican they're voting for. And so hopefully, with your guys' support, and as a movement as a whole, we can push for individuals in the state of California to start voting based on policy, not on Democratic Party line. And I think fundamentally, if people just research these candidates, they're going to be doing they're going to be doing much more conservative. They're going to have much more conservative voting practices. So thank you very much, and I'd like to pass it off to Sarah Dominguez, my friend who's running for California State Assembly District 30, 37. Thank you, Elijah. Yeah, Elijah and I are going to be partners up in Sacramento, okay? So when we put out different bills and everything, we'll get them voted in on the assembly side, he'll get them voted in on the Senate side. So that's what's really going to make our change. And yes, I am a conservative, uh, Christian, America First candidate. I believe in the Judeo-Christian Constitution, and I believe that we are a republic. We just use the democratic way processes, that's all. So um, I just want to let know, people know that we are not going to win unless we get our names out. So if you can help, if you can help fund us on our websites, that it's wonderful because we're, we're now putting in a lot of money for our yard signs, our banners, our communications to get our name out there so people know who we are. Because we're not going to win unless we get all the votes. We need lots of votes. If you didn't get my card on the back, right here, this is where people could actually register to vote. 
Okay, so if you know people that aren't registered or they're not sure what they're registered, they can do it right here. This is really important. We get more people to vote. Um, I can't say that enough. And then over here, I come.